This is a very uh, interesting question. I don't know how to answer this necessarily. Toughest one. James LeBlanc asked, great game for a first or second date. Please, uh-huh. as, please assume the person is not too heavily into gaming. I, I have no idea how to answer that question. I got, I I would, got five suggestions. My first suggestion would be, I don't know, maybe don't play don't a do game. It. Don't, don't play do a it. game. <laughs> don't play a game, maybe. The only winning move is not to play. <laughs> yeah, I think it might be. I think, you know, I mean, unless the person has already said they love board games, in which case the second part of your question doesn't make sense because you said not too heavily into gaming. All right. So here's, here's my thing. Oh, geez. You want to do it. You want to go for it. I say, <sighs> it's a risk. I say it is a risk. Huge it is risk. a risk. But guess what? Just go to dinner. It might be worth it. If, <laughs> if, 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 if she seems down to clown, if or she he, seems, or if she seen, or she or he seems seems like they they might, you know, they're they're a little geeky and they might get yeah. into something a little out there. I will say that I could see the mind being a very interesting. Totally. That's a good call. Interesting game to play on a date because when it works, if you can get it to work, you create this illusion of telepathy between yeah. the. All two All you're of looking you. for is an icebreaker, right? On a first, I mean, he said yeah. first or second well, date. That's you don't know the but person, it's a, but it's a way to connect with them, right? It's the, a lot of, but, but hold on, a lot of long eye contact. With that's a what I'm saying. That's a good that's thing. Uncomfortable eye Look, contact in, with a in a first or second date with somebody you like. <laughs> what you're looking for is you're looking for an accelerator. You're okay, looking for me. how can I break I've down. invited you on a date. It's our first one. We're, we're romantically interested in each other. And now I've just said, stare deeply into my eyes for 20 seconds straight while trying to guess a number. <laughs> but no, you didn't say that. The rules said that. Uh, yes, exactly. I, we, I just, we're just doing what the rules what say. What else you got for, these, for this probably mistake choice? Codenames duet. Okay, yeah, sure. It, is a, it, is, a, it is a two-player Codenames game. Breaker, which breaker. Once a game, it, it, it's an icebreaker, but once again, mm-hmm. it is can we lock minds? Yeah. Can we be thinking about the same thing? Because if you can, you create that, right? This is a relationship accelerator. This right. is a thing that, wow, you know what? We really, we really synced up there, and that is attractive to people. It is right. attractive to people when you can have a moment where you sync up with somebody that you barely know, and it might create that that a little bit of intimacy a little faster than you would otherwise. All right, I have one recommendation. Give it. 1830. <laughs> if they say yes, you just you go get that's a ring. It. That's go it. Just get, get a ring. ring. Right now. Vegas. Go get the ring. Vegas. Yeah, immediately. Tonight. Just you, if they say if you put that on the table and they go, oh, I've been dying to play this. You say we're not playing this. We're getting married. And then last but not least, I will just I'll give one more. I will give it. We'll give the whole thing. Uh, there is a very simple game called Spot It. Yeah, Spot It is a game where you have a round round cards. Everybody gets a hand of however many or, or whatever. You flip over one. And you have to figure out which pattern, which symbol of the nine symbols okay. on the on the thing sure. matches the one in your hand. So you're trying to quickly say, well, no, that the bumblebee isn't the same as the one the one that I have. But, oh, the sled. The sled is mine. And boom. Right. And you grab those cards. And you're trying to grab those cards. So it's a little bit like spit where you're trying to grab things as fast as you can. But yeah. it's also pattern recognition. So in terms of... I don't need to make strong eye contact. I don't need to to pull that into it. But it's just a, a kind of fun, quick little mental game. Yeah. That's a good one for that. Look, if you want to give it a shot, my my, my overall uh, mantra in gaming is never try to make a non gamer a gamer. Just find gamers. Correct. Don't uh, don't, don't force people. Nobody wants to play a game unless they want to play a game, and you shouldn't want to play a game with somebody unless they're dying to play a game.